Wala ka bang magawa sa bahay o sa buhay o bored ka? Well, kumuha ka ng kamote, hugasan mo at hiwain na parang potato fries. So, we're gonna make a sweet potato fries. So, kumuha ka ng kaldero. Lagyan mo ng tubig at magpakulok ka ng tubig. I-open ang kalan hanggang mag-boil. Ayan, once na nahugasin mo na ang iyong kamote, it's time to peel. Ayan, nabalatan mo na ang iyong sweet potato, it's time to slice like a potato fries. Ayan, hiwain ang sweet potato or potato sa size na gusto mo. Sa kumukulong tubig o sa pahulong tubig, nalagay ng konting asin. Hello in. And then ilagay ang sweet potato. Hintayin ko mulo for 3 to 5 minutes then get it done. Ang bawal kumuha na, maglagay, kumuha maglagay, maglagay ng ice, crush, and then ice water. So, ayan, Rhea, siya sa bulb. Sasalain natin siya. We need to drain the water. Ayan yung ating sweet potato. Ayan, again, na natin sa cold water. Sa kabilang panig, magalagay tayo ng oil sa pan. While I'm doing the one to cold, so I use in basic oil, so I can use any type of oil here. So when the sweet potato cold down, we need to transfer the thing in a tissue or a toilet or a kitchen paper towel. So we need to get this dry before we put some flour or cornstarch. look good right? right this is dry and clean so i'm going to transfer that right to here next i have a corn flour in here you can use about one tablespoon or two tablespoon here it depends how many you use it. So for now, I use only a table. sit for three to five minutes and then we're gonna fry it so, so we're going to try our oil is hot enough mm, i think it's hot enough we're gonna try some so the oil is ready so pretty little but not much there
I'm gonna put this twice. This is the first one I cut, and I'm gonna do again. I'm gonna cut back again later. So that way, our sweet potato or fried potato is crunchy. I did not both fall at the same time so that we that we so that way can be and she or you know even just repeat the process until your potatoes cook and crunch crispy if you have a big pan then much better so because you can put all the stuff in there so we're going to cook both this again. This is not crunchy enough yet. And it's my last box. So this is the whole thing. Just cook about 3 minutes. You know you want to first cook. And now we're going to reheat again for half hour. And then we're going to put it back again until it's crunchy. Sweet potato price is ready now. So just let the oil drop first and the just for okay. We need to do that again. It's the second pass. That's simple, right? This is our sweet potato fries. And you can put some salt in there. Just a piece of salt because you don't want it to be salty, right? And also, you can put some cheese on top. I'm gonna use some Mexican cheese blend or forest cheese blend. I'm gonna put some on top so that it can be melt. You can put as much as, as, much as you can, but for me, it's just a little bit that's fine. And that's it. So, bon appetit and enjoy your food. Bye. Thank you for watching. So, hi guys, this is my sweet potato fries with the cheese on top and some sweet carrots. Don't have some pinch of salt. <laughs> guys if you have a ketchup or tomato ketchup and have mayonnaise too if you don't like anything like in there so you can put tomato sauce in your thing and you can make your thousand island just put how much you want you know just mix all this stuff together or just two ingredients or if you want to add some paper in there or some mustard it's okay too just mix all this stuff together Thousand Island sauce, and you can dip your thing in there and eat. Mmm, crunchy and soft inside. And that's it, guys. Thank you for watching. Yeah.